Hello, everyone. You're welcome to this channel once again. Today we have a question from a thermodynamic reference. Now let's read to the question given to us. Octane CH H18 is born with 150% theoretical hair. The air fuel ratio on the molar basis for this combustion process is what? Once again, an octane gas C8H8 is born with 150% theoretical air. Calculate the air fuel ratio on molar basis for the combustion process. Now we were given a fuel which is octane with the molar constituent of CHH18. Now, how do we balance it? under stoichiometric agreement to balance octane under stoichiometric agreement we know that octane as a fuel CH18 plus the constituent of air which is X let's say the molar the mole X we don't is, is unknown yet with the constant of oxygen with nitrogen, which is the whole major constant of air, equals CO2, which is carbon dioxide, plus water, plus nitrogen. Now, how do we find or balance all the constituent coefficient X, Y, Z, W? By balancing this the whole fuel and here under this combustion process we can find out that our x becomes 12.5 and our y becomes 8 and our z becomes 9 and our w becomes 47 this is something we can find mathematically and algebraically now that we have find all our coefficient of the combo of the constituent of combustion, we have this particular stoichiometric equation, which is well balanced. Now, so therefore we have CH8 18 plus 12.5 into bracket O2 plus 3.76 N2 equals 8 CO2 plus 9 H2O plus 47 n2 don't let us forget that we are supposed to find the air fuel ratio now looking at this particular balanced stoichiometric equation our air constituent are this which is 12.5 into bracket 0 to the bracket 0 to plus 3.76 nitrogen now in looking where that our air constituent here we can pull this out to find the equivalent percent, uh, constituent while burning under the chamber now from here we have one kilo more of octane CH18 burns with 12.5 into bracket 1 plus 3.5 Seven six kilomole of air. From there, we can deduce that for one kilomole of octane, which is CH eighteen, twelve point five times four point seven moles were born. So that gives us fifty nine point five kilomole born. Now, don't let us forget that our theoretical air as a percentage of 150 
percentage. From there, we can deduce that 150 percentage, which is equivalent of 1.5, is multiplied by our calculated kilomole of air. So that gives us 1.5 times 59.5. That gives us 89.25. So therefore, our air flow, our calculated air flow ratio gives us 89.25 to the ratio of one. That is, when the in the in the combustion chamber, when the 89.25 kilomole of octane is born, then the equivalent one ratio of it of air is born likewise. Thank you very much.